Hello. Colin. Colin. Casey, man, what the hell? We're making the movie today. Come on. <sighs> I'm sorry. Forgot. Get going. Okay, okay. It's just, uh, you know, it's just in the morning. Mm. Oh, it's for breakfast. What the hell, Lance? God damn it. I'm not in my room, am I? No, you're not. I'm sorry, Colin. Oh shit, you're sorry. <laughs> Shut the camera off. So, uh, oh, who was that in the... I don't... Casey, I don't want to talk about it. Just go away. I don't want to talk about it. Well, uh, I kind of... Not sure what to think here. It's... I just need a moment of peace. Just one moment. I'll be good. Well... Hey, college. What the... Get out of here! Dick? My roommate. Say hi to him next oh, time. Oh, that explains it. Uh, what do you want to do with this movie now? Well, well, you're in charge of your job. Well, just go around. I want you to document what everybody does. What I do, what I think. I don't care how horrendous, bad it gets. <laughs> I want you to document. I want the audience to know every painful moment. Every painful moment. I mean, we had that interview that we filmed last week. That went really well. I actually, I really like that. We they got a little bit of insight about how we how we wrote it. Mm -hmm. I, I want, I want, I want you to know that behind the scenes. Yeah, it's all that behind the scenes stuff. All that segment we did about writing, and uh, I want you to put that in. If you really don't mind, I'm, I'm actually, uh, I'm, <laughs> I'm gonna pass out now. Okay, writing a movie is not as tricky as people think. Um, for example, the first script I ever actually uh, wrote was um, I took a copy of The Matrix and I just copy and pasted the entire thing and I replaced, you know, little bits and details like I changed Neo's name to, to Philip and, and I rewrote the script to my liking and and really, you know, that that's all it takes to write a script if you're someone as talented as myself. Um, now, I wouldn't recommend doing that for, like, re legal reasons. But occasionally you can do the trick. Now, some writers, when they're making a script, they go through all these different phases, and you know, it's like they start out with an idea, they keep working it up, working it up over and over. Me, I, you know, I go through that phase. You know, I, I'm, I'm writing down stuff, I'm throwing it out, writing down stuff, throwing it out, you know, uh, and it, it starts to add up after a while. But, you know, I, I guess I do best when I find little loopholes to get out of things. So, the thing I figured out was all these writers are just, you know, they're throwing in little pieces of paper and then poof, after they've thrown away all these scraps of pieces of paper, the idea comes to them. I skipped that step. I just threw out the entire fucking notebook, all right, and bada boom, bada bing, I had an idea, and that idea was this movie. Hey, what's happening here? Oh, uh, I'm actually just writing up the character sheets for each of the individual characters. Kind of try to want to keep them in my mind when I'm writing the script, so. Oh, how do you uh, get in the character's mind? Well, you know, it really depends on the character. For example, if I'm writing like a, a lead hero, I'll maybe, you know, stand in front of the mirror, pose with like a, a gun or a little hat or something like that. Now, you know, you feel a lucky punk, I'll pull all the, the dirty Harry's tricks, you know, and all these, these little bits and pieces. So I get exactly into the mind frame of that character by acting him out. And what about for a female lead? Female leads? Um, you know, I, I just, I strictly try to imagine it in my head as to what a girl would be like. I, I wouldn't, I would never act that out at all. You know, that would just, that'd just be stupid. What? So my, my writing idols? I guess you would say would be like um, Shakespeare. That's a good one. He, you know, wrote a lot of the classic plays: Hamlet, Romeo and Juliet. Very important figure. Charles Dickens wrote classic American tales. I mean, it's just the images, the imagery in your head is just mind-boggling. And he has a funny name too. You know, that bonus points. 
I would highly recommend that people read Aristotle. It's you know it's real ancient, early writing, but very good, very good. And probably uh, anybody who's ever written for Playboy, because it really is about the articles. Um, you know, I mean, there's other stuff in the magazine, a lot of other stuff in the magazine that's good, a lot of stuff, but the articles too. There is that other stuff too, and what? I guess the biggest thing is that every morning, you know, you you gotta you gotta ask yourself, you gotta challenge yourself, ask questions. You know, like I'll sit down and I'll eat my cereal, and I'll say, "What if I wrote a character who liked to eat cereal? What would that character be like? Who who would he be?" And I'm pretty sure that's how somebody came up with like Captain Crunch. Now the idea for Attack of the Killer Slugs just kind of came to me. So you know, I've I've had a working script, you know, every morning, up until the morning of production, and uh, and so on. I will be constantly revising the script. I think this story is something everybody can relate to. It's a human story, deep down, and I think we need to tell it. I think it's my duty as a filmmaker to tell the story. You know, it's one of those feelings that I was placed on this earth to tell you this story. I don't I don't know why that's my only purpose in life. I would question a higher being's morals if this was the script they handed me, but all the same it's why I'm here. I am I'm here to make a difference. I'm here to change the world. So, uh, what are we doing here? We're actually uh, waiting for this guy. Uh, huh? oh. Yeah, he just came in. Oh. Wow. He's an actor. I've worked with a couple of times now. Um, he's a good he's guy? A, he's a, no, he's a dick. Um, but the point is, we need actors, and he'll do it. He can do it, all right. He'll do. Hey, buddy. Hey, what's hey, up? Yeah, how you doing? Uh, I'm making a movie. Oh, an honest to fucking god movie. It's gonna be huge. It's huge. Not, it's not one of those movies you kind of cut and pasted. No, 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 no. This is gonna be a full-length, honest to god movie. I want you to play the lead. It's, it's... Can you help us? Well, it's not that I can't, but you know, I usually drive a harder bargain. And just hey, come act with me. You know me. I need stuff. You know, like Ooh. water. Water. Um, I get thirsty. You know. Okay, Fine, you get, you get water. You get, I'll, get, I'll, I'll one-up you. I'll get bottled water. Bottled water? That's some good stuff. Care. Hey, I heard that, but oh, it's fine. It's still Bottle. water, but more importantly, obviously my figure tells you I need food. You're right. Okay, you are, <laughs> you're absolutely right. I'll go and get a stack of frozen pizzas, and we'll bake them up. It'll be fun. We'll eat that every day. No. Uh, frozen? Because frozen pizzas can be gross. Yeah, that's kind of low quality right there. Right okay, there. fine, 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 fine. No frozen pizzas, okay? <laughs> I'll go down to the to the, to the boxcar place at the end of the street, okay? They got good pizza there. We eat there every Friday. Fine. I'll, I'll get you pizza from there. Is it greasy? Only the greasiest for you. Yeah. And you see, he agrees. I think right. that's good for me. Okay, go. okay. Do I get a trailer? Um. You have to provide it yourself. I might just do that. You can park it in my backyard, but you get the trailer, sure. Okay, cool, that's all I need. All right. I'll, I'll do it, yeah, I'll do it. I right, owe you one, man, you're, yeah. you're a good guy. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I like you too. Yeah. Nice. Yeah. Right, yeah, have a good day. I can hate that guy. But he's talented, so it won't make a difference. Um, maybe you should pull away from him. Mm. He kind of threw something at me last time we talked, so. I know. Yeah, I hate him. He's. A douche, ass, bitch. You get, you get the drift. So, what's going down today? Um, we're actually doing auditions today. Oh? Huh? Yeah. 
I figured this would be a good location. I called the actors up uh, over the past week and see yeah, what kind of turnout we get. Did you get some good responses? Actually, nobody's called back yet and it's been a week. I mean, I gave them location. It's obvious. I mean, it's you can't miss it. Yeah. I mean, look around you. I mean, I've been here. I've been going back and forth between town and here for five fucking hours and not a fucking person's showing up. This is bullshit. What more do they want? What? So, Colin, you gonna be okay? No. I'm not gonna be okay. I'm not. I mean, I play on this off for a week and nobody shows up. Oh, no, no. They'll, they'll be here. Just wait. No, there's nobody gonna show up. We're in the middle of the fucking farm in the middle of nowhere. They can find it. They'll be, they're on their way. There's nobody, in Casey, nobody's gonna show up. We got somebody here now. Nobody's gonna show up. Yeah, sure. I'll cheer you up. I don't think so. Guess who? Well, it's either gotta be Death or Megan. It's Megan! Fuck. This is the best you could do? Well, yeah. This is bullshit. She can work. This is bullshit! Hey, man. Is he always like this? Yeah, pretty much. Hey, Colin, where is everyone? Fuck you, bitch! Ah! I think you're gonna like this surprise. Just keep going. Keep them closed. Okay. Yeah, you'll like this. There we go. A little more. more. Alright, open. Huh? What the hell is this? This is your auditioning set. Really? Yeah. This is where you can select your cast. Yep, color coded pens. Yeah. This is the nicest thing anyone's ever done for me. Oh, stop. Well, I mean, you got, you got, you got everything. You, you, got, you got the little pens. I, I, can, I can highlight the shit out of things. <laughs> and and, and, and it, copies of my script. You got me an idea notebook. That's how you got to make a movie. Oh, this. Oh, mm -hmm. that is. Yeah, I'm sorry. I'm sorry I was so moody earlier. It's just, I, I'm, I'm pissed off, but this, this, you got me water. It's just for you, bud. Thanks. I mean, really, thanks, man. Thanks. I'm super psyched to be here. I mean, I'm the only one that showed up, so I'm gonna get a part, right? Right? Um, you know what? I'm I'm feeling pretty optimistic now. Yeah. Uh, I'm ready. Actually, bring in, bring in some people. I want to audition people. Okay, Megan, you ready to get in here? What the f***, Colin? We're in the middle of a f***ing barn. No wonder no one showed up. It's really nasty in here. Hey. Someone could have died or something. Shut kind of the f*** like up, Megan. Out. Okay? You know what? Fine. Somebody is gonna die in here, and it's gonna be you if you don't shut your mouth. You know what? If I'm so underappreciated, then I'll just leave. I was the only one that showed up, but whatever. F*** you, bitch. Yes! She's gone! She's actually leaving! Yes! Just kidding. I'm actually here to audition for Liz. So, uh, go in and... I can't. I can't hey, say it. I hey, can't. I promise. It'll be fine. Yeah. Just... Go and, 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 and read the line. Okay. That's right. Yeah. This yellow one? Yes! The f***ing yellow hey, line! Calm, read that one! Calmly, calmly. Yes. The freaking yellow line. Go ahead. <laughs> read that one. Can I stand up? Yes. You can f***ing stand up! Is it? Yes, you can stand up. Okay. What? Are we going to do? We're all gonna die. Okay. How about we add some fucking emotion into it? Say none of that. A little bit more emotion. Right. What are we gonna do? We're all gonna die. Actually, that, that wasn't too bad. Um, I, I liked it. I actually, I, that one wasn't bad. Um, yeah, I, I'll give you a call back in a few days. Yeah, yeah, you impressed me. You really did. Um, and you could go. Thanks. Thanks for showing up. Yeah. Thank, yeah. thank you. Yeah, that's okay. Hey. Okay. hate that bitch. So I guess I don't even really care that he was yelling at me. I mean, he was being sincere and all. All that pent-up aggression. I wonder if that's what he's like between the sheets. You know, I just saw a sign for this and figured why not try out. The director might be a nice guy. Who knows? Colin, we got another audition coming. 
We do? Yeah. Um, what is this? Oh. Uh, <laughs> Hello. Hi. Um, that's a very strong handshake you got. Thank you. Very big muscles. Um, thanks. Uh, yeah. <laughs> I mean, uh, <laughs> thank you for showing up to audition in such style. No, thank you. Yeah. So, uh, which part are you here to audition for? I'm going for survival of one. Oh, well, uh, you'll need a script then. Thanks. Don't mention it. Yeah. So, uh, how about you read the part? Arg. Ooh, that was good. Wasn't he good? That was beautiful. Ooh, man, I felt like I was being attacked by the slugs in my cell. You know, could you read that same part, but do it, turn your arg in a bit more of a moan, like a, oom, like that, and do that three times in a row. Arg. 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 Ooh, man, he's, he's good. That I. I don't know if I can justify giving you a smaller part of this. I mean, you are obviously talented. It's brilliant, man. Obviously. Um, you got the part for sure. Thanks. You definitely have that part. Thanks. Maybe a bigger part. But, yeah, all right. I, uh, I, uh, ooh. God damn, you have a strong handshake. Thanks. Yeah. Yeah, you can. Thank you. Thank you. Hey, Colin, is that a picture of the last no. audition? What the f***? How did you get up there? It's my job. Um, no, this is, um, mm, uh, that's, uh, some reference photos. I, I need them for later, and... How the f*** did you get up there? You take pictures of every audition? Well, it's... Yeah? Yeah, I do that for everybody. It, no exception. Uh -huh. it's, it's, it's called talent searching. Okay. Yeah. You can come back down. I'm really excited for this audition, because I think I'm a great actor. I've been in a few different productions, Hamlet, Romeo and Juliet, and Cats. It should be a fun experience. Um, okay, next. Hi, I'm Andrew. I'm auditioning for the part of Jed. Oh, you know, there's something I can't quite place, but I kind of like you already. You, you seem like you'll do well. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah. So, um, I want you to just read the lines that I put on here. Okay. Mm -hmm. uh, read the highlight one, and I'll feed you the rest. All right. Okay. Let's go right now. Mm -hmm. Liz, I tell you, it was the slugs. They came out and attacked the guy. Yeah. Then the third fellow started acting all strange and flopping around. Do you suppose there was something wrong with him? What are we going to do? We're all gonna die. Get a hold of yourself, woman. Okay. Um. No. What? That that was horrible. I acted better than you. Shit could act better than you. Megan, the daughters of death, could act better than you. What the f*** was that? I, I thought I did really well. I, I, I thought I played the part as I should. I'm, I'm sorry, as a guy you seem alright, but as an actor that's insulting that you would even think to come to my set. You need, no, you need I'm, to leave. I'm, I'm I will call, I'll, I'll call you back, but I'm sorry, you, you blew it. No, Go. I, I'm the one that's sorry. I, I can't believe it. I, I thought I was good, but maybe it was just an off day for me or something. How was it, cats, man? Cats! This isn't turning out as good as I thought it would. No? What's the matter? We're still. We only had like three people show up to audition, and we're, we're a couple parts short, I'm not gonna lie. Well, how can we make the movie then? Uh. All right, desperate times call for desperate measures. Um, okay. I'm going to call Lance. Lance. Oh, your roommate? Yeah, the dick. Um, I'm gonna call him. Fingers crossed. Okay. Um. Hey buddy, um, I was wondering if you could maybe, you know, come down to auditions. What? What for? Um, well, 
kind of didn't have a lot of actors show up, I'm not going to lie. And I, I need people to, to audition for the parts. Yeah, but uh, you've been kind of a bitch to me lately. Okay, I'm, I'm sorry about that. I really am. All right, I really am. But you could make up for it if you just showed up. You do it? Yeah. All right. Okay, I'll, I'll see you then. Casey, you know who the hell I am. Why do I have to do a stupid confession? Hey, buddy. I'm here to save your movie. Oh, hi, Lance. Um, you know, if you could just, if you could just read, just read the parts off, please. What are you so down for? Nobody showed up. I mean, it's been a bad day. Just please. Please read the part. Okay. Um. Say, what's that thing in the sky? Could you could you read that again? Say, what's that thing in the sky? It was brilliant. I didn't know you could act. Thank you. <laughs> you gotta save my movie. I'm I'm your friend too, Colin. Yeah, you're gonna save my movie too! You're gonna be my movie saving friend! <laughs> oh. Oh. What's Casey still doing here? Casey, I just told you I don't need to do this. You stick that f***ing camera in my face every morning. <gasps> Colin, Colin, this way. Cody, she already knew that. Yes. You are a fing legend, alright? You 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 are you you played bodyguard number eight in that movie! It was incredible! It was, wasn't it? Oh my god. Why are you here? Did God send you? No. When I was making Love She's Three very beautiful women, and I thought to myself, why not do another crazy thing in my life? Super awesome crazy thing. So you're making a movie and I thought I'd come check it out. Dude, that's f***ing awesome! Are those real? These are all real, 100% me. Oh my gosh. Oh. Holy shit. Can I touch it? You're on? Please? You're on for this movie? Oh my god. Alright. Okay, if you're gonna do this movie, there's only two rules. One, stay away from her, she's a creeper. Two, you act the shit out of that script. Please. Okay, so deal. Hey, rule number three. F the script. Cause I'm the script. Deal. Fucking amazing deal. Oh my god. I've been gorgeous. It's him. Fuck yeah. Oh my god. I'm supposed to tell you about how I feel about making this movie, but. Instead, I like to tell you another story. Uh, when I was making that movie, that made me so so rich. Uh, I met this girl and I ran a train with her sister. I fucked her mom too. So, how were the auditions today? Um, I felt overall they they went pretty well. I mean, we finally did get the people to to show up. Um, we got a celebrity in the movie that now. That was pretty hard stuff. It was. I mean, that, that just, I don't know, that made my day. You know, I did not have a lot of hope for today. I was, really? I kind of, you know, I don't know, I really should have had a lot more faith that today would just work out, you know? Yeah. So, here we are, the end of the day. We got most of the movie cast, and, um, well, the future officially looks open, don't you think? I'd say so, yikes. Beautiful. Hey, what you working with now? Uh, it's getting the camera ready, checking the settings, everything on, so I think we should be good for today. Oh, we're going to be able to use it? Yeah, we can actually start filming today after weeks, actually. Ooh. So, that'd be nice to finally get that out of the way. Uh, first day. We got uh, Derek and Lance filming their scene together, so 
should be pretty good so long as they both show up. Mm. So, uh, yeah. That's I'm always the hard part. Huh? Yeah, it is the hard part. So, I'm pretty excited. You ready to go? Let's do it. All right. What's going on with the camera? The lens is all jammed up. I don't know quite what we're going to do here. with it right now. It might affect the zoom. Uh, oh, no. I really can't tell for sure. Can't film like uh, that. Here. And on top of all that, we have a bunch of problems. What now? Uh, hey guys, I'm here. That being one of them. <laughs> hey, uh, whoa, good, what? You're like all loose at the jaw, man, what's wrong? Uh, Novocaine. Man, I told you, you don't go to the dentist when we're doing dialogue scenes. I never went to the dentist. <sighs> Christ. You're gonna be all jabber jab, like blah blah blah. I, the audience won't be understand a word you're you're saying. They can't understand a single word. Sure they will. Oh, uh, I can't feel my jaw. Okay, you're gonna have to sleep soft something. I mean, at least you're reliable. Lance hasn't even gotten here yet. We're an hour behind schedule. You have until he gets here to get rid of it all. Clear? Now, could you just, I don't know, take a nap or something? That's disgusting. Just take a nap and. Yeah, just, what the hell? Could I have one actor that's not on drugs, please? <laughs> hey, um, I think I got this thing working. All right. Mm-hmm. Can I have the word? Disgusting. Hmm. Hello. Hi. Hi. Who is hey. this? Um, this is uh, Amanda. I, I was looking for some help at the last minute, and I found her on the street. She said she could do the job for five bucks. Ooh. So mm -hmm. who am I doing the job for? Well, your job is to uh, hold the camera. Ooh, kinky. Uh, yeah, it's actually going to be a pretty cool movie. Um, you should meet Derek. He's one of the lead actors. Derek? Yeah. Okay. Uh, so I just wanted to kind of introduce you to people. Okay, we have a bit of bad news. This is our first day of filming, and there's another guy who's supposed to be here. He promised me he'd be here. His name's Lance. He never showed up. It's been two hours, and we don't have hardly any time left to film. So, uh, okay, it's beside the point, but I just want you to know. This is Derek, okay? And uh, I'd like you to meet him. Come on, Derek. Buddy, I got I may want you to meet. Right there. Lance? Yeah, that's a good idea. I, I, I didn't even think of that. You, hmm. you know, I mean, look, we could, come on, buddy, we could totally pull this off. We get a photo of a Lance, and we put it over her face. Mm. And, I mean, she had the same, similar features to Lance. I mean, you know, <clears throat> you know what I'm saying? And I don't think the audience will be able to tell the difference. We'll just do the shots real fast, random. Uh, can you do kind of a whiny voice? If you want to. And there we go, we got a Lance. Ha. Hmm? Ooh. <laughs> got his photo off Facebook and scotch tape on the back and the genius. That is gonna look slick. It's genius. Alright, just uh, hold it mm. for a second. Alright, so we just put it over a face like this. And I don't think anyone can tell the difference. Watch, uh, watch. Look this way. Derek, uh, Derek. Mm. Look who's here. What the f is that? Um, okay. <laughs> well, anybody but Derek can tell the difference. I mean, look at this. This is going to be perfect right here. We got the we got the nose, got the hair, everything. The whole features. We'll just, you know, we'll use a little bit of trickery with the camera, and you will not be able to tell the difference. We can get this scene done today. I like it. All right. Let's go. All right. First scene, first shot. We are officially in production. All right. Scene one, take one, and action. Uh, Colin? Yeah? <laughs> we don't have a script. Shit! Um, no, wait, I got one. I got one. It's, it's, it's good. It's good. Um, one somewhere. Okay. Mm. All I need you to do is read the line for James, and she can read the lines for Jed. For Jed. Mm-hmm. All right, do you, want, do you want to read them? I can't see you, asshole. 
It, Maybe you should just feed her the lines. All right. Your first line is, what's that thing in the sky? Okay. And then you have this long one too, but we'll, we'll cover that when we get there. All right, don't worry. It'll be a second take, okay? All right, we ready? Okay. Ah, All right. Game time. Game face. Okay. Okay, uh, scene one, take two, and action. Say, what's that thing in the sky? I don't know. Sure don't look good. Cut, cut, cut. Who was that? <laughs> William Shatner. Man, you're supposed to be a redneck. You didn't say William Shatner? No, I said redneck. Oh. You think William Shatner would say, yeah, probably don't look good. We're redoing this. Get down. Okay, scene one, take three, and action. Say, what's that thing in the sky? I don't know, it sure don't look good. Um, cut, all right. That was a pretty good take. Uh, like what you were going with right there. I really need you to act more manly. I mean, I know it's complicated being whose shoes you're filling, but really, you could just reach down deep inside and pull that manliness out. That'd be great. Are you gay? No, I'm not gay. I just need you to act more manly. Okay. But so far you're doing better than I thought you would. Okay, uh, I think we're ready to move on to the next shot. So, all right, scene one, B, take one, and uh, action. I still can't you see. Oh, um, Derek, uh, can you feel him? Yeah, you're right. I think we should probably go check it out and make sure it's safe. Yeah, good idea. All right, um, cut. And yeah, I thought uh, that was good. That's the word I want to use, good. I thought you were good. Okay, it's a given. And uh, all right, I think we can move on to some reaction shots. So I want you guys just to react. Remember that the huge uh, meteor falling from the sky, and that's what you guys are watching, okay? So uh, let's get uh, ready, and uh, yes, Derek, what? So what's my motivation? Uh, that's a pretty big word. I'm glad to see you're using that. Okay, uh, your motivation is that there is a huge f***ing meteor falling from the sky that will probably hit the earth and wipe out all life. But probably. I'll still live, right? Yeah, you'll still live, obviously. Obviously. Yeah. Okay. Um, and, uh, ready? Okay. And rolling action. And there's a huge meteor falling from the sky. React, react, react. Okay. And we're going down the end. React, react. Uh, on me. No, no, we need to get two reactions. Okay. All right. And react. More facial expression, please. Okay. <laughs> and cut. No, it's kind of so-so. We should probably, we should redo it. Yeah. Okay. All right, we're going to be doing a second set of reaction shots. I want you guys to really get into it this time. Just really give it your all out. Are you ready? All right. Rolling and action and huge meteor falling from the sky. React, react. All right. Hand down, hand down, hand down. Okay. No. No. My camera. No. My camera. No. No. I'm not done yet. You are in, out of the <laughs> shot. No. No, Derek. No. No. No, Hi, baby. No. 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 You are not touching my crotch. No. No. Camera. Camera. No. No. Cam. No. Ooh, a hat. <sighs> Damn right. Is it always like this? Yep, pretty much. Oh, you. Cut. 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 <laughs> Take it off. Take it off. Take it off. Leave it on. Leave it on. Not bad. And. Good, good, good. No! No! 
Okay. You suck! And... Cut. That's a wrap, ladies and gentlemen. That's a wrap. Good job. So how do you think we did today? I think we did pretty well. I mean, uh, it was all, all... Don't be a kidder, it went awesome. It went pretty well. Um, My Novocaine's gone now. And That's super. We have our prima donna back. Hmm. Um, what the hell's a prima donna? You see what I have to work with? Hmm. Is that a director word? No, it's not a director's word. You know. And uh, that new girl, Amanda, I thought she did uh, pretty well. Can I take this freaking thing off now? No. Okay, uh, I really appreciate everybody showing up at such short notice. I know you're all wondering why I've called this emergency meeting. Hey, Colin. Casey. Hey. He's really the He's only a... one that showed up? Well, just one. Okay. Why? Why are you here? You suck. You're the worst actor I've ever met. You called me! Well, admittedly, that was because when you came to audition, you left your wallet here. Oh, so you got it from here, right? No, I threw it out five minutes after you left, but I called you to let you know that I did that, so... Alright, I might have a job for you. Alrighty. Do you think you could be uh, the cameraman for the movie? I think I can do that, but don't you already have a cameraman? I had a girl who was operating the camera, but she was a whore. I know, people are just terrible to work with. No, I mean literally, she was a whore. Uh, she showed up to the set, I paid her five dollars. Instead she stood in for Lance all day because he never showed up, so... Is there anything else you need to tell me before we start filming? Oh yeah. But I'm pretty sure you already know. I'm moving. Why would I know that? You... You never told me. Are you kidding me? I left... 12, 13 messages on your phone. I told your office assist assistant that I'm gonna be gone. I left sticky notes in your office, in your car, in your room, in your laundry, and check your shirt. Okay, number one, that's not possible. Because one, I don't check emails, I don't believe in post-its, I don't have an office assistant, and I just don't... My laundry? You're kidding me, okay? There is nothing in my laundry, you... Exactly. Okay, well, smartass, let's see what they say. Yeah, we'll see what smartass is. Bye, Colin. That tells me nothing. That, that could be buy for the day. I'm moving. Whoa. You're moving back and forth on the couch? Uh, that doesn't tell me anything. I'm leaving by. Okay, you're leaving to go to the store to pick up some eggs. I don't know where the hell you buy. Damn it, Colin, I'm going to New York. Exactly. Okay, well, you didn't even say you're New York on here. You, you, you said NY. That could be I'm going to, to next year. So unless you got some sort of f***ing time machine, that's not going to happen. Okay. It's cool. It's cool. You can continue to work on my set for now. Just don't pull any more of this bullshit. I'll, I'll try. All right. Now leave. You just gave me a job. Why don't leave? Leave. Why? Because every second you're in this room, the that decreases the chances that I can ever get laid. So, leave. I'm go. I'm now, go I'm go going. I'm going. You're taking away valuable seconds of my sex life. And gone. We're clear. We're clear. <gasps> I don't know. With, you know, I've got to pick up all these notes now. Andrew's probably left notes all over the place. So, I really just oh, don't know what we're going to do. Yeah. So, some chips. What the hell, Lance? What? Um, what's going on? Um. Ugh, it feels. Colin, I got a. I spent a lot of money. I bought these shag carpets. I bought these two lamps. They don't match, but that's okay. I got the wood paneling. And to top it all off, I got these curtains. It should be sexy in here. It's not sexy. What? What the fuck are you doing? Well, funny you should mention it because Andrew was just in the room. That's why it's not sexy mm -hmm. in here, okay? Who the, who the hell is that? You would know if you ever actually showed up to the movie set. What movie? Mm. You're kidding me. No, no. The movie I've been shooting for the last couple of weeks. Um. The movie that, <laughs> ironically, you're supposed to be the lead actor in. 
you you know you you did mention that. I remember a little bit. It wasn't going so well though. I didn't. I thought we were it done. It wasn't going so well because you never showed up. You I, showed up and you distinctly said that you were gonna save my movie. Well, you never saved my movie. Colin, Kush, what? I'm here now. Do you, do you need me for something? Uh, yes, I do need you for something. Could you actually, you know, film a fucking scene? Today? Today! I could do some filming today. Are you doing it today? I can if you will actually show up. I'll, I'll be here. All right, I'm here now. I'm, I'm not going anywhere. All right, you gonna try? No, no, no. I, 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 I want to know because I called you up. You said you're gonna be here one day. I had to have a woman stand in for you the other day. Okay. I'm here. All right. It wasn't so, pretty. It wasn't. Okay. Don't try and weasel your way out of this, you little bastard. I'm not. If you need me, I'm weasel. gonna be here on this couch with these chips. I'll be right here. Okay. I'm okay? gonna come get you. I'm gonna get the camera. We're gonna get going. All right. You're moving, Colin. You. All right. Um, I'm looking over, and I think we got a scene we could do. Ooh, what's it about? Um, it's where uh, Lance's character Jed yeah. uh, discusses with Derek's character James uh, over what they're gonna do to basically counterattack these slugs. Ooh, so, Jed. very pivotal scene. Mm -hmm. And uh, I'll just need Lance to get it. Lance. Lance! Get the fuck off the couch and get over here. Lazy? He is lazy. This is ridiculous. <laughs> what do you want, Colin? Uh, we're gonna film the movie. Remember, like you promised? Yeah, I remember. We got the lights set up and everything going here, so why don't you take a seat? I'm gonna go over this with you. Alright. Talking about a very pivotal scene. Did you hear what I was just talking about to Casey? No. I have, there's some Jed, pizza. James, sitting down. Jed, which is your character, by the way? No. I didn't. You didn't know that? Nope. Jed is your character. You and James, who is their character, are sitting down discussing how you're going to get rid of these killer slugs. So, so, we're doing that today? Yeah, we're doing that today. Derek isn't here. I'm aware of that. Thank you. I've thought ahead. Alright? I'm just trying to help. Well, I'm saying I've thought ahead, so it's all good. Okay. Um, I figure since you bear more resemblance to Derek than myself, uh, you could play Derek's character and I'll play your character. No uh, problem. Um, what do you, why don't I just play me? Because that would just be stupid. You really can't play yourself. Can he play himself? He can't play himself too you well. Can. What the, your name. It, no, that it doesn't work. Okay. It's just fine, okay? Just, just, just go with it. Just go with I, it. I prepared. We've done this before. It works perfectly. Good. Where did you get that from? Um. Or in particular, I mean, I just, I just had it. Colin, I haven't seen that picture in like five years. I don't, I don't think it's any big deal. I mean, you don't really, you don't need to know. It's a need to know basis. You don't need to It'll know. It'll be all right. Okay. okay. Whatever. All right. So I want you to go over your lines. Just repeat them a couple times. You'll get them down. It's really no big deal. Uh, I don't need to see the lines. Why don't you need to see the lines? The script's right here. I don't even know the lines. I, I can do it. Wow. You mean to tell me? No, he means, he's trying to tell me that he walked into a movie that he's never acted in once so far. You've never read the script. Yeah. You didn't even know the fucking movie was being made up until like half an hour ago when I told you, yes, Lance, we're still making the fucking movie. <coughs> and you're just going to walk in and say, you know, all the lines of the script. Yeah, I, I know all the lines in the script. I got it. Trust me. Well, okay, well, I'm too involved with this project to really give a shit. Andrew, are uh, we ready to go with the lights? Yep, yeah, yeah, almost ready. All right, good. Let's go. All right, get in character. And from the top. Okay. I don't know what we're gonna do. We're gonna <laughs> die. <laughs> Pull yourself together, Jed. We we can think of things to do. I can't pull up anything. I can't pull anything again. <laughs> Jed, Jed, stop crying. We could we can find other people. I just want to find my masculinity and my manhood. I can't find that anywhere. <laughs> God, I don't sound like that. Yes, you do. Just roll with it. Get your character. We can, we can try different things. We haven't tried everything, Jen. No, it's hopeless. We can't try anything. We're going to die. Jen, We're gonna die pull it together. Down. Quit crying. No, I can't quit crying. I want to, but I can't. Colin, I don't sound like that. Yes, you do. I wrote the character, Lance. Just stay in the f***ing character. I... 
We get, come on, we can't just sit around here doing nothing. We, Let's we, just get ourselves into this slug. Death is the easy way. Let's do that. I love the easy way. All right, calm. That that isn't me. I've had enough. It's you, Lance. I, I swear it's you. That's that's not me. Okay, okay. It, it, it's the character I wrote. I'm doing the character. No, this, doing the character that has your likeness. This is me, and you're just mocking. No, so. I'm not mocking you. I'm staying in character. No. You need to stay. You're breaking character. Hey, hey, try and work no. with them here. Casey, would, would Derek ever complain like this? No, yes. he wouldn't. He wouldn't. Okay. Stay in yeah, character. Stay in the character. No. Up there. I'm, no, I'm don't, done. don't walk out. It's the character land. Right it's now. It's the character. Done. Whoa, whoa. It's the character. Hey, you promised. Don't walk out the door. I'm Lance. I'm a little douchebag. I whine all the time and I storm out whenever anything goes bad. <laughs> oh, uh, I, I hope he never comes back because I mean, he's just such a whiny little bitch. <laughs> Oh, hi. Hey, jackass. I came in about five minutes ago. Oh. <laughs> Shit. Shit! Andrew! Hey, I'm, so, I'm sorry, guys. What did you do? What the hell did you... Andrew! It was an accident. This is like a $10 lighting rig. You can't afford to fix it. I gotta go to the hardware store in the morning and fix, you know, pick up new parts, everything. I'm sorry. More work for you. You're an idiot. Stupid. You too, Colin. You're an idiot, Colin. You. Yeah, fuck you, Lance. Oh, I'm gonna shove you. Man. Real mature, Lance. This is bullshit. Oh. This, is, this is bullshit. Okay, Casey? Why? Alright, because the fucking hardware store is closed. Well, it's you, closed. We can't do, do the scene. That? Lance won't show back up in the morning. It's bullshit. We'll, we'll never get this scene. Take a deep breath. No, Calm it's down. bullshit. Calm. I, I thought of something. How about we just camp out at the hardware store? When it opens up, we'll be there first thing in the morning and get your light and get this thing rolling again. How about we just camp out at the hardware store, da, 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 and we can all go back to Berryland. Everything will be fine. No, Lance. Colin. It's not going to happen. Colin, I'm serious. It, you know, it would be like that time we went and uh, stayed for um, Star Wars Episode One. You remember Phantom Menace? You son of a bitch! It never happened! You took a bow! You took a bow, Lance! That never, ever happened! You son of a bitch! We took a bow! <laughs> just a suggestion. That movie sucked. <coughs> it sucked. You remember Jar Jar Binks? That movie sucked. <laughs> I like Jar Jar Binks. Son of a <coughs> bitch. <coughs> but, uh, that suggestion about, uh... Excellent suggestion. Yeah, that suggestion about camping. That was, that was, uh... That was good. So how do you feel about another day of filming with Colin? Eh, not, you know, I'm not worried about it. I mean, mm. he's okay. But, you know who shows up? Who's we that? have a problem. That Megan or whatever. Ooh. Yeah, she kind of not drives me nuts. No, she's annoying, demanding, nags, a slut. You know, yeah. if, if one of these days, per se, she would come out of nowhere and just, I don't know, die, I would not be upset. <gasps> Whoa, whoa, Um... What the? <laughs> oh. oh. Holy shit, that's Megan! Yes! Bullseye! What are you talking about? A, I hit a person! Barely! It's Megan! Oh my She's God. the daughter of death, she's already dead, she can't feel pain! You, Colin! <laughs> oh, she maybe died. she can feel pain, but... <laughs> I didn't, I didn't know she was going to be here, so it's not your fault. Oh, okay. Should I, should I go park? Yeah, go park. Okay. Oh my gosh. Hey, Megan. Are you glad you showed up to the set today, right? She on my way. Uh, just back up a little bit. You'll be all right. You'll be good. Hi. Don't touch me. Ooh, she doesn't seem too happy. Yeah, oh. you're good there. Uh, Derek, I I think you killed her. Uh, she she can't be dead. I was going five miles an hour. Well, apparently it doesn't take much to kill her. I mean, five miles an hour. I mean, really? Yeah, five miles an hour. Let me make it. I could, maybe, I could out, maybe like four. I I could outrun that. Okay, she really couldn't just you know like hopped off to the side or outran the car. I wouldn't. I would think normal people could. But you know, the sun doesn't take that much. You can jog okay. at that speed. Uh, I'm gonna see if I can just wake her up because that, yeah, that just shouldn't have killed her a few times. Come on. Ah!
Well, she's fine. <laughs> yeah. Now we understand you might be a little upset. You know, it's it's, it's understandable. I want to. Yeah, I want to go to the doctor. No, that's no. not gonna happen. I'm like, um, Colin. No, no, I'm no, no. Sure. We got it. Hey, we, hey, we got good news. We there got a blood? surprise. We got good you. news. We got a surprise. Andrew's Andrew, here. Andrew. Okay, we had Andrew uh, uh, pick up a wheelchair on the way over. He's on the wheelchair. We got you a wheelchair, Andrew. You know the guy who who auditioned before you or camera after guy? you? Camera actually. guy. Yeah, he's our camera guy now. He's he's real nice. Yep, I hate him. Nice. But I really, he's nice, and he'll help Can we, you I, move this along. Get in the chair. Okay, uh, Andrew, bring the chair closer. Oh, but I don't know if they'll be able to roll on these. Can't you yeah, roll? Oh, that's a good idea. Here. Why do we, why do we put it in the wood chip pile? I don't know. It's really, I didn't she think it through, but there, okay. Right? Yeah, yeah. I feel like I'm bleeding on the inside. Just shut up, okay? Get up and walk oh, yeah. to the chair. I can't get up and walk. Okay, Andrew, while you're in town, yeah. I want you to also get us some ice cream. Ooh, ice cream ice sounds cream. good. Yeah, ice cream's really good. Um, what do you want? Uh, I'll take vanilla, but what do, you, what do you want? Do you want to try something different, like maybe like blue moon? Can we? Uh, I, I think I'm going to Shut up! Die. Shut no, up, Megan. We're talking about ice cream. I'm just so sick with you up. yelling like this. Okay. I think I'm dying, though. Okay, sherbet? Okay, uh, sher sherbet. What kind? Orange that that or rainbow. Rainbow, rainbow. 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 sherbet. Like, oh, yeah, yeah, try that stuff. stuff. So we're getting rainbow. Yeah, yeah rainbow, rainbow sherbet. No, no, she's not getting it. Andrew! She does stupid stuff like this. Yeah. Um. Can you want some rainbow sherbet? Yeah, it's going to get some rainbow. Can you get the wheelchair? Uh, no, no, uh, no, 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 hold on, we're talking burgers about ice cream. Burgers oh, and fries. One burgers second, and, and take fries. yourself right. over there. Yeah, you, you guys okay. want for a special place or anything? Burgers and fries from where? Oh, dang it. Um, just the new place in town. New place fun. in town. Yeah, the new, right. the, you know find the newest place yeah, and go get. Got. Everybody's there. Um, yeah, everybody's could you there. give me ketchup with the fries too? Ketchup? Yeah, ketchup. Lots of ketchup yeah. or a little. Yeah, lots of ketchup. Wait, wait, get in the chair. Come on, this is slow. Are you today? This is not freaking complicated. Get in the chair. Okay. I hate you! Um, and burgers and fries. Burgers and fries. For and everybody. Lots of ketchup. Lots of yeah, ketchup. everybody, I want. I want to buy a uh, bottle of ketchup. Gobs right. of ketchup. Do you, want, do you want double burger, Casey? Uh, Yeah, I go for double. Right. Okay, double. Who's All paying right. for this? Uh, You are. Of course. Yeah. Okay. Right. So if, if it's but, no bother, uh, yeah, but you I'm go hungry. ahead and take care of that. I'm really hungry, though, so if you could get All the right. food and come yeah, back I'll and then bring it. I'll get the food and then take it. I think I'm going to get the food first. Food first. Could you put it on the dashboard of your car so it stays nice and warm? I really like a mildly warm burger. Okay. So, hey, hey, food hey, first, go. man. Okay. Gotta remember the stuff. I gotta chill. It's in a steel trap now, guys. Put her in the car so she's getting crazy. I'm getting really lightheaded, Andrew. All right, guys. All right. All right. We'll see you in a little while. Yeah. Be sure to buckle up. Hello. Oh, no. That's kind of a shame that we couldn't have her, you know, to, to film the scene. But I mean, she's just gonna whine and bitch like that all day. I don't. You hit me with a car door. If she's just gonna whine and bitch like that all day, I don't really want to bother with her. It's okay. We can find a replacement. Yeah, we could get a replacement. Casey, I know people. You, you think we can get a replacement? Oh, her? easy. Yeah, we'll find her. We'll find a replacement. We can, no problem. I, I can go through my phone book. We can find somebody. Yeah, that's no problem. Um, so yeah, I'm, I'm, I feel a little bad. I mean, normally I'm a prick to Andrew, but I I feel really bad doing this to him. Well, no one wants to be stuck in Megan for more than two minutes. I know. Well, he's just, a nice guy. He's good for. Yeah, it. he'll be all right. I, but if he f up my burger order, I'm gonna be pissed. Oh yeah, hey, if it was like onions or something, oh Man, she boy. is just a squeal. Don't over. forget onions on mine, okay? Onions? Yeah, uh, I don't like onions, so none for me. Okay. Make sure she doesn't bleed over the back. If you do, make sure you pick up the fabric cleaner. Fabric cleaner will get rid of blood, so if she starts God. gushing blood... Damn get, it, Megan, I said no! Get fabric cleaner while you're out, too. Okay? All right, well, I was uh, thinking into what shots we could do today. You know, it's kind of ironic, but I think we should do Liz's death theme. It didn't really originally call for that, but I want to write it in the script. We'll just get a double for Liz, and you can react to her death. So, you weren't going to kill her off in the beginning? No, but I figure under the circumstances, we should kill Megan's character off. I mean, that's Liz. We kill her off. I get it. It's good. Oh, oh, hey, he's back. Hey, Andrew. Hey. So I got your ice cream, but you'll be proud of me. I did not get onions. What? what, what, what? But, but what about the burgers? And the fries. Yeah. And you can't forget the bottle of ketchup. What? Oh. Oh. Andrew. You did, did not you... get burgers and fries? That's what the onions were for? That's why we said no onions? Oh. That's why he said no onions? I wanted onions? So why you could have at least gotten the onions? Hey, who would eat onions on ice cream? Onions so you did get the ice cream. Ice cream. Did you... No, 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 no. Well, and, I, I don't answer. want to be mad. I don't answer. want to be mad. Did, did, you got the ice cream. I, I got it. Okay. It? So on my dashboard. Duh. I oh. said to put uh... the burger 
on the dashboard. No, to keep them warm. Oh, that makes sense. Yeah. Then they would melt. Oh, I got you now. So, so what, what happened? Could you just wait? wait time on the ice cream. It's on the dashboard, right? So I'm trying to put two and two together here. It's fucking melted. I was getting to that. Just shut, shut up. One second. Okay, fine. I suppose I should act like act like a care. What happened with Megan? Well, they let her go, though. She's right in front of me. They just let her go? Yeah. She's a little banged up, though, but really, who cares? Well, it's at least on the bright there. side, you won't have a lawsuit. So, um... Yeah, that's true. I um, don't worry about that. That's, no. that's not Megan. Is, is it? No, no. I, you're, you're asking me? I'm pretty okay, sure it's okay. Megan. Okay, I'm, I'm pretty sure Megan has, has blonde... Oh, yeah, blonde short, hair. Short blonde hair. I, re I distinctly recall that. Yeah, blonde, I remember that, too. Who the fuck is that? I mean, really. Is that... It's not Megan? It's not Megan. I... I I don't know. The doctor, Who the hell did you walk out of the hospital with? The doctor pointed at this chick and, that, and said, take Megan out of here. Time on. No. Do I remember this? Was there like a line of patients, like a line of them? And he's pointing in the direction. There was a lot of them, like Did, so many. So, so <laughs> is there a distinct possibility you might have grabbed the wrong person? Yeah, like when he pointed, was there just, a, just was possibility? Because really? I really don't think that's Megan. Because I have a feeling Megan's probably still in the hospital. Well, she's probably pretty fucking pissed at you specifically. She's or me. Pissed. Or she's a bitch. No. Yeah, she is. She is a bitch. But you did not grab Megan. You got like a total stranger. I don't know. Who, yeah, who, who, I don't know what we're gonna do with this. Who cares person. of Megan? But we gotta figure out what to do with this. Well, I suppose you, you I could have just... experience in this matter. Wait, wait, no. We could return her. Yeah, they have return rates. Yeah. Is it like a fourteen-day return policy at the hospital? I, well, I think that's around the. I, I know it's one person that you know she had a kid or whatever, but it wasn't. She really didn't have a kid. She just thought she, she was high. Whatever. But you know. She went back to the hospital, returned the kid, and she was like a couple days late, blah, blah, blah. It's like a $50 charge. But I think we have enough time to bring her back the same day. $50? It's the same day. Yeah, yeah, we shouldn't get charged, right? You just got to take her back today. Just yeah. take her back right now. So we'll, we'll do filming. No, no, we'll, we'll film first because we'll, I don't want this little bastard, you know, weaseling around because he's yeah. going to mess something else up. I just want... I probably will. Yeah. I just want you to go and just stick her in your car. And make sure you roll on the windows so she yeah, has plenty air, of air. air like a dog. So know. just take right. her and put her in the car. She should be all right there. I mean, she should. It doesn't look right. like she's all there. So okay. uh, she, she should be all right. Is she dead? I don't, I don't even, even know anymore. Uh, no, she, she's kind of giggly. I think she's probably a dementia, probably yeah. dementia patient. Yeah, I don't know what that is. But he'd want to tell you. I don't all right, well, yeah, I'll take her in the car. In the car. Uh, I got okay, the I don't know upstairs that should help with the giggling. Yeah. So Or what you do. Like it in, that helps too. Or not. Yeah. gas. Glove, just glove just box don't let anybody Big know jar. that you f***ed up that bad. Alright guys. So anyways, um, what I was thinking with this scene okay, huh? that we should do is uh, we could just have Andrew fill in as Liz and uh, he could, I got like a blonde wig and we can just give him a blonde wig. So. That'll teach him too because when he screws up this bad, he used to be Megan. This is a problem. Alright, we'll work on that. Let's, let's do that. Okay. Mm -hmm. Now, this is a very pivotal scene. This is very dramatic, very emotional. Your character, Liz, is dying. The killer slugs are on their way. You are going to die. And it's true love between you and James, which is their character, and it's pivotal, and you're sharing your last moments with one another. I but need I, to feel the emotion. I never love her in the entire play. You want to screw her, okay? It's the same thing. It's not yeah. love. Yeah, that's, that's fake love. It it's fake love. I don't really care. You guys met each other a couple hours ago, so it can't be true love, okay? Just roll with it. That's your right? motivation. I want right you there. to channel the emotion. And look into her eyes and tell her her final it's goodbye. Not even a girl. Close enough. This is true. Okay, let's go. All right. Rolling. And action. James, I don't think I can go on. But I can't leave without you. But you must. Okay. James. All right. I like it. James, I don't think I can go on. But I can't leave you. You must. Okay. So Colin, what, how are you going to put some killer slugs into your movie? Well, I'm glad you asked because I actually have been
pulling everybody together here so I can kind of work out our special effects scenario, which is ironically going to be a centerpiece of the movie, so it's essential that we get this right. Right. So, uh, what I'm thinking is uh, I, I uh, went to some concept art classes, uh -huh. and I spent a long time with this, and I, I got it down, I got exactly what kind of I had envisioned the slugs would look like. Okay. So, um, yeah. This is my initial concept. This is my vision of what they would look like. That's your... <coughs> Sorry, I just tickled you, you my throat. You want to say something, Andrew? I told you I tickled my throat. That's just your primary thought, right? Uh, That's just my primary thought. I uh, I kind of thought it over and I realized they weren't they weren't that threatening. Right. You know, I mean, these things are going to take forever to go around. I really they weren't practical. Mm -hmm. So I, I re envisioned, I rethought, and yeah. I actually came up with this. Ah, okay. You know, I figure they're more threatening to have, they have feet now, they're more threatening. That looks like oh. a f***ing mutated dog! Andrew, you don't even know what the f*** you're talking about, okay? I'm the f***ing director, I know what I'm talking about. You literally cannot go one day without bitching about something, okay? Even if it's just as basic as concept art, alright? But you know what? I didn't let that discourage me. I didn't let your negativity discourage me. I actually took the liberty of taking that energy and putting it into something useful. I actually drew concept art of what it will look like when we're actually doing a scene. Everything from what's going on in the scene, what the actors are doing, to what I'm doing, oh, to what the camera is doing. Look, huh? Yeah, this is everything. This is a complete scene plotted out for us. Okay. Oh, Alright, oh. can you see that? Sure, sure. That's our actor reacting to the slug. Okay, obviously going to be added in and it's going to look real nice. Um, Horror. That's Andrew on the camera there. I particularly like this camera angle because the higher mm. camera angle implies dominance, makes it more scary. Ah, uh, yep, yep. Now this smiling fellow right here, <laughs> you see that? Yeah. That's me. I'm smiling. Oh. Also, I have a dagger and I'm Ooh. stabbing Andrew in the head. Ooh, what? Why would yeah. you do that? That makes Because it makes me happy, you know? You make movies because they make you happy. Ugh. This is a concept of what would make me happy in this movie. And it ends with you ultimately shutting up forever. I don't know if any of you realize this, but uh, modeling clay is pretty expensive. Ooh. Oh, yeah, it's gonna, it it's yeah, it's gonna yeah. set us back way more money. Yeah, than money's we tight. And I'm thinking what we should do is uh, skip it all together, save us some money, and go with computer generated slugs. Ooh. You know, I found some free programs online. It's yeah. easy. It's fast, and they're they're far more convincing. They make us look like we're like we're legitly in Hollywood. Mm -hmm. All right. So. The problem with that concept is that we do need to have somebody stand in to be the slug. Something for the actors to react to. Uh, we need to put dots on them. So they can computer mo track the motion. Right? Tracks the motion. You know, you yep. just lock Derek, right? Computer. Derek. No, 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 no. Not Derek. Derek is the lead actor. He's, uh, he's very, very important to this uh, movie. He's going to have to react to the slug. Even, even Lance here. He's very, very important to the movie. So I need somebody I can spare. I'm looking for everybody that I can spare, but the only person that comes to mind at the moment is you. Other people will come along, obviously, that I can throw in and have to do this, but I want to do the initial tests with you. All right. All right? All right. You're not going to f*** this up. No, why would I f*** it up? Oh, sorry. That, uh, that's the little you're going to f*** up meter in my head. What? It's going this way. This is the red. This is like your engine is going to explode. That's where it's at. Okay. Well, I'm not gonna. So you know, are you gonna fuck this up? No. What You're gonna fuck it up. I'm not gonna fuck it up. I'm not gonna fuck it up. I'm not gonna fuck it up. Okay. I'm not gonna fuck it up. Oh, we're out of the red almost. Swear to me. Yeah, I swear. I'm not. You're not gonna fuck this up. That you can just stand there and be this thing and not fuck it up. I will. Okay, it's stabilizing. Okay, I believe that you won't f*** it up. You got a safe right. reading? For now. Okay, okay. Okay. Oh, okay, we're back. Do not f*** this up. Okay. We're counting so, on you. I think we can, uh, I think we can do some tests later, and that's what we're going to do for this movie, okay? Okay. All right, good. All right, you guys, so uh, I just want you guys to all get comfortable getting character and everything. We're going to be going off into, uh, uh, on location today, and we're going to be filming the sequence where the killer slug kind of leap out and attack you. Okay. 
So you guys can just uh, get in the van or whatever if you want. I'm gonna go talk to Casey. Andrew, can you hold off? I gotta have a talk with you quick too. All right. All right. Wait. Come over here. All right. What's happening? Um, I'm kind of worried about how they're gonna react. Uh, I don't think that their reaction. To the slug? Yeah, it's not gonna be realistic. And I mean, I really don't trust them. Uh, mm -hmm. So what I want to do is, uh, if you could just, could you just drop us off in the middle of the woods mm. or nearby a woods? Okay. I guess you kick us out of the van. You say like the, the van's got a leaky uh, tire or something like yeah. that. And you got to go out and fix it. Okay. You go, you go like make like you're going to fix it. You stay in the van. We all get out. Okay. And then you just drive off and you leave us I in the middle of the woods. I like what you think. Okay. Yeah. We're going to get perfect reaction. Okay. Yeah. So I'll take the camera. All right. All right. All right yeah. Okay. Um, we good? We're good. All right, and uh, could you give me the uh, microphone there? Okay, okay, we're good. Very nice. All right, and um, Andrew. Yeah. Yeah, come over here. Okay, so you just go in the van, keep the guys uh, coming. All right. Okay. All right. Um, we're gonna we're gonna drop these guys off in the middle of the woods. All right. Since you're not an actor, I'm not too worried about this. But. Uh, I want you to be a, a, a slug. I want you, as soon as we kick them out, you need to go off and hide. And I'm going to give you points where you hop out and you surprise them, okay? Okay. All right, so you get in the van. You don't know what's going on. Lance and Derek don't have a clue, okay? I know nothing. Okay, let's go. go. Hey, dog. Hey. All right, get in the, get in the front seat, Andrew. Run. Hey. Hey. Back, back seat. Back seat. Hey, right. come on now. I'm coal captain. Yeah. Okay. Stop pushing. It's all right. Easy now. We're good. All right. So, uh, how do you guys uh, feel about uh, being in this movie, huh? I'm freaking hungry. I love sitting in the back of a van. Yeah. I mean, okay. We don't have a lot of light left, what? but it's uh, it's gonna. Whoa. What? Okay. Okay. Whoa. Wow. All right, guys. Casey. Yeah. Hey, tire went out. One out. All right, come on. Let's, let's just get out. Come on. We gotta we gotta move. We don't have a lot of time to film this. Okay. Uh, we don't have a lot of time. Come on. I got this. I got it. Don't worry, guys. Muscle Magoo right here. You know which tire was? Yeah, I don't know. Oh. All right. Um, no. Okay. No. We'll just oh. fix the tire. We'll just fix the tire. We'll just fix the tire. Casey, where are you going? Casey. Casey. He's left the, the door's way. open. The doors. Wow, guys. He just left us. Uh, he just left us out here. I mean, how? Wow. That, I was so out of character for him. What? Oh man, we're stuck out in the middle of nowhere. This is not good. I mean, there's, there is nothing out there. Um, how about you two? You two could just go and talk over there for a little while and figure out what we're going to do. I got to talk to Andrew, okay? okay uh, this is it. a really bad situation, okay? Just go over there. Okay. Okay, uh, now, it's your, now it's your point. I need you, uh, I need you to go hide. Hide? Uh, okay. Just, just go off and hide, okay? Okay, I'm going to go. Okay. All right, yeah. you guys, uh, I, the, we have like a storm front or something moving in here. Yeah, okay. So we really need to find the woods. It's not too far away, but we need to go in there and figure Don't out. Don't worry, I, I can smell it from here, my Indian blood. Okay, yes. so just follow me. Let's, uh, let's go off to the woods. Come, Come on, on, just follow me. Let's go. All right, um, this is obviously a really bad situation. I mean, we've practically, we practically been abducted, man. I, we're just, Casey left us. What? I, I don't know what we're going to We might die out here. Wait. Why don't, you know, why are we just standing, you know, we could, we could try and walk back, uh, the way we came. I think I remember a little uh, bit. Dude, 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 dude. What? Look. Derek, what the hell are you doing? Oh, me making spear. Derek, what do you need a spear for? Dude, we've been out, we've been out here for like... Two. Two minutes. Two minutes, okay. Two. But I'm hungry. You just ate before we left. Dude, I'm sure when, I, could you please talk some reason? I don't, Derek. Put put the stick down before you hurt someone. Okay. Here. This isn't even sharpened. It will be. One but, at a time. No, okay, I like this. He okay. gives me a dull stick. That's okay. Um. Okay. I really get. I just want. What are you feeling right now? Describe I, your emotions to me. I, I, you people are idiotic. You, why? Why am I stuck in the middle of a forest? Derek, could you could you please tell me your emotions? What are you going through right now? I want you to. Tr shh, shh. He's tracking something. Ah! Did you just stab a rabbit? No, 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 wait, I think... Is that a chipmunk? I don't... Either way. Okay, okay. Colin just put yeah. his snicker bar in his pocket. No, no, no. No, I don't, I don't have a snicker bar. I don't... You lie. 
I don't have a snicker bar. You told me. I want you guys to just... Okay, we really we really need to keep moving. We don't have a lot of light. This... Go. Uh, Where are we going? Just, I want your reaction light? here, okay? To what? I just channel what you're feeling, you know. Get in touch with yourself. Make I sure don't... you're still human. I'm not touching anybody. Okay, I'm okay. just I'm just saying, just make sure you're <laughs> feeling human here. Sharper. This is essential. He's this is sharper. He, no, he's scaring me is, with that knife. Derek, just just Derek, just calm down. But watch. Okay. Ooh. Um. I swear, if I get cut. Um, Come on, come on. Do you want me to sharpen your spear? No. Get out of here. Just stick okay. your beard. Okay. okay. Ah! What the? Ah! It's, it's, it's Andrew. Andrew. Ah! Shit on me. Ah! <laughs> Colin, bump Colin, for this. Colin, what's going on here? Why is it? No, why is no, 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 no. I, it, um, it, it's not Andrew. It, it, uh, a, a crazy, crazy slug. person. Crazy person. Ah! Slug. 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 Give me, give me your reaction. Ah! Colin, we need an actual slug to react to. No, no, to. no, no, no. See, these, I, you're not thinking creatively, okay? I stuck you out in the wood. Derek, ah! please, Derek please put it they, down. They look please like, put it down. They look like heart stickers on his face. Okay, that's decided. They're motion trackers. They're going to be yeah. filled in with with a with a alien later. I don't care what they are. That's what they look like. He's not scary. I am. Damn it. Ah! Stop. Okay. Don't touch me. I will sock you right in the suck. Oh, no, no, I'm no. Sorry. Sh sh okay, guys. Seriously, though, what is Derek doing? I don't. I don't know, but I'm, he's. He's at least entertaining. I'm following him. Yeah, what do you do? This is the guy. Shelter. You're not thinking this. You found shelter. Shelter. Shit, how long do you play as being out here? Do you have a phone on you or something? We can just get out of here. I threw my phone out. I want you guys. You, you guys, this is an oh. essential scene. I want phone. reaction. Derek, oh, look no. at that. Oh, no. It's got service. Derek. No phone. Shelter. Derek, okay, Derek, I, I was actually counting on Lance's phone. I was, dude, this is not even funny. I was, okay, I admit, I was, I was, I was making a joke. I was making a joke, and this is not funny anymore. Derek, you broke my phone. You, you seriously broke Lance's phone. Uh huh? You, you broke his phone. It's dead, oh, and what? And I hate you. Shelter? Are, where's Casey? Do you know where Casey went? Did you yeah, okay, he was supposed to park around the corner and wait for me. Obviously, never... what? there's no corner in a forest. Uh, shit, I didn't think of that. Um, okay, it's beside the point. It is beside the point. Okay, <laughs> we, will, we will survive, we will get out of here. Shelter! We, Derek's we got wait wait no no shh 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 wait wait Lance Lance hold on hold on I think I see what civilization what? civilization what there's what? civil there is civilization that how, way how far I don't know it, it Ooh. I like like five clicks you plan on I don't know that in terms give me in miles three three and a half Derek how does up. he know no, this three know. and a half I don't know Do you but think there is fucking there is a fucking thunderstorm. Moving in. If we go that way, we I'm find not, shelter. I'm not Real walking. Shelter, I'm not, not walking five clicks in a thunderstorm with it's this three guy. Miles. Derek, Derek, could you please, could you please put down the knife? We have only been out here Kay. for like five minutes. You guys Does get a choice. Off? No. The bugs are fine, bad. Fine, 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 fine. You got, you, Shut up, Andrew. What? You guys get a choice. It's either a spear or the knife. I, my I'm taking spear? the knife. I'm taking. Okay, thank you. What do I get? You Andrew, spear? shut up. Um, Andrew, shut no, my up. Spear. What? I'm just Okay, right, let's go. I'm f***ing losing my mind right now because we're in the middle of the woods and I was expecting that we could just do There's this. There's a light right over what? there. It's like a mile away. I see a light. See that light? No. Farmhouse no, light? five clicks. What about five clicks? Five clicks? Three and a half clicks. Okay. I'm not even five clicks. Probably like a mile. You lied to us? You're a liar. Let's go. I do follow me. You lied to us like six me. times in ten minutes. Yeah. That's impossible. Why is everything my fault all of a sudden? It's supposed to be yours. What the hell? Derek's, you can make it. Derek's going to keep me alive. So I'm, I'm sticking to this guy now. I, you told us to start walking. We made it like 15 feet and we're stopped already. Okay, it's not I, that dark. Why are... I, I'm just sorry. I want to say I'm sorry I got you in this situation. Yeah, I don't believe you. What the okay. f*** is he doing? I can hear civilization, okay? I, I know we're, we're close, okay? Do you know how loud trains are? That could be 10 clicks away. Okay, I don't know Nick? what... Derek, shut What up. are you doing, Derek? Journal. You see what I mean? We've been here 15 minutes, and the guy thinks he needs to make a log of every time he takes a crap. Okay, Derek, this isn't Walden, okay? We'll be okay. We'll be okay. Andrew, are you okay out there? Sick of this. This Day guy. one. Dude, I don't know what we could do. That could be... Day one. Dear God. Okay, yeah. I see the train, Far but that... Away. I see the train, but that, that could be like a... Casey that could be like a 10 or 15 minute walk. I don't know if I'm going to make it. It's going to rain. Casey it is going to rain, okay? We might get mildly wet, okay? This is really starting to get on my nerves. No, we're going to get wet, and Derek's just going to start chasing geese or some shit. Goose? Der God, Derek, geese. really. Why are you Derek, talking like Derek, that? Derek, 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 Derek. Derek, really, you have to listen to me. There is a thunderstorm coming in, okay? There's a thunderstorm. We can go train. Jump on train. 
there no there there is a thunderstorm coming in there's going to be like all if we run to the trees okay i know that there are bears derek i know that there are bears out here and they will find us if we go on the tree bears they will find us no okay so we have to get we have to get over there you think do you think if at, after a 15 minute walk i'm gonna have the energy to jump on a train oh Colin, i can't i can't go on i'm on it's really out of breath it can't even be another mile in it's, it's you told me this was like a 10 minute walk away and we're still in this damn field it's been like an hour okay okay what what, what andrew I think there's been a barn behind us the whole time no 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 andrew that can't be what? like there's no barn andrew what? wilson there goes derek i think derek's lost his mind really derek we've been out here like it's been 20 f***ing minutes now, okay? I'm sure Casey just drove off to go get something at the gas station, okay? We'll be okay. This, we're, we're in a cultivated field, Derek. We're not even in the woods anymore. Good leaf for shit. Derek, Colin, you know. A barn right there. Andrew, you don't know what you're f***ing talking about. Barn? There is, if I were to turn that direction, there would barn. not be a f***ing... Barn. Barn. Are you joking? Barn. Um, okay, well, smartass, it, it doesn't even look like it's inhabited. We could go there, there could be a bunch of f***ing serial killers and rapists in there, and Derek is just running off towards it. If Casey that's comes back shit. with, like, a soda or something... Stop, no, Bye. we don't know who's at the barn. Stop, Derek, no. Derek, wait up for us. <laughs> oh, yeah. No, no, we don't know who's in there, Derek. You don't know what you're... I really House? didn't plan this much about. House. We're not... You're not thinking clear. I don't know who's in there. There's I don't know, farm guys. Farm means We're farm. We're going. Farm. Let's go. You guys don't know who's in there. What is Casey here? Shit, I didn't think of that. Casey! Oh. Casey! Is this your farm? What are you just saying, guys? Casey! Come on, guys. Casey! Is this your farm? Other side. Yeah. No, no. Side. You guys, you guys, be careful. Yeah, Derek. Derek. He's got Derek, Derek, Derek. He's here. Derek, there's nobody here. Spear. No. It's like they've been wiped out, man. Basketball. I, Basketball. No. Wow. He remembers. He remembers. Um, oh. Oh. Come on. Is that? Wait. Life? There's a house. Come on. Come on. Is that you, you can make. I, come I on. Food. Oh, oh my. Oh, Corn? oh, wait, Corn. wait a second, Corn. you guys, this is a, this is the same barn I auditioned you guys at. What? Oh shit, I didn't even realize, we were only like, we only like went on the back, I only like went on the backyard. What the f***, Colin? I, I, I'm sorry guys, I didn't even realize it. That's okay. Oh. I'm back now. For some reason I see a house, I'm like not survivalist anymore. Oh. When I get, when I get oh. the spear. That's you know, okay. I, don't, I don't say it uh, often enough. But you're an idiot. Okay. Let's go. Let's go find Casey. Okay. Okay, yeah. guys, we're clear. Oh. We're safe. And, oh, Casey. Yo. Casey, you son of a bitch. Hey. You said you'd be. You said you'd be right by. Well, yeah. Okay, we're on the middle of the fucking woods. We don't know where we're at. All right. There's we no almost place. died because of you. Was there even a I had to. Tire? Well, oh. there, I had to keep circling to find a place to park and figured oh, screw it. Shit. It's a house. We called for you. With a barn. Okay. Okay, what just you guys, you guys, you guys, you guys, okay, it's my, it's my fault, my fault, just go, just go in, just please go in, and, and cool down and get yourself some drinks. Okay, okay. just go. Help yourself. Just f*** you, Colin, f*** you, Casey. Whoa, chill, yeah. guy, you guys, Casey, it. chill. Bring something to okay. drink. Okay, Andrew. Oh, yeah. Okay, alright. Uh, you know, I've been thinking about it, maybe yeah. I should just give the camera back to you, because... A lot of bad shit that happens. That works camp. best, ain't it? Yeah, how about you just, uh, you take it back. Good thing. <sighs> okay. Very well. We good? Well, today, yes, this lovely, uh, woods experience. Yeah, uh, he was, I think, I thought it was brilliant. I mean, the idea of him telling Casey to drive away and leave us behind. I really got to embrace the environment, my human being inside, I think, you know? Where did this goofy head? Who was that? Yeah, he's an idiot. Like, I was saying, like, I got to be a true 
survivalist, like that guy on the Discovery Channel, I can't think of his name, but you know, you know, you know who I'm talking about. But yeah, I mean, I got to make a spear, I killed a chipmunk, that's what people told me. Was it, was it a chipmunk? I think chipmunk. So. chipmunk. And I, I think Kyle understands that I'm the greatest actor in the movie. Lance is terrible. Colin's doing fine. Casey's a good cameraman. Andrew's a little bitch. I'm great, of course. Well, I already said that, but I'll say it again. I'm better than everybody else combined. Except for maybe Colin. He's pretty good. Casey. That was a good acting on his part, making me think they actually left this behind. So, overall, I gave it an 8 out of 10 today. It would have been better if Andrew wasn't there. Come on. The heart thing. <laughs> but, yeah, all over. It was pretty good. Well, the uh, the woods was quite an experience today. Um, Colin, oh, Colin, do I look like a douche in this hat? Because Colin looks a little bit like one, so I just figured I'd try to fit in around this set. Um, I don't know, Colin, he did some good acting today with uh, Leaving Us in the Woods, as Derek said. Um, I can agree with him there. And the other thing I liked about his little interview was that um, Andrew's a bitch, because he is, he is pretty whiny. Um, I'm getting real sick of that. I wanted him out of my house. But, uh... Yeah, I think maybe Colin should do a little bit of acting in his movie. I know he's a director. Maybe we could switch it up. We could give uh, Derek the camera. Colin could play me. I'll play uh, Andrew. I've always wanted to play Andrew. But I can't do that better. You know how that goes, right? That'd be pretty fun. But uh, I don't know. You think you'd go for that? I think I think it'd be pretty cool. But today, today was good. We got good good shots done. It's pretty real. Um, Kind of scary with uh, Derek with that spear, but I'm still alive. No cuts, a couple bites, scratches, but all in all, I'm still alive. Well, I thought today was a good day, hanging out with the guys in the woods, but I really think I connected with them. I think they really see me in a different way, you know? Uh, nope. We still hate you. Fuck you. Give me that. You're not cool enough for that. Thank you. A five. Ow! Ow! Well, anyways... I think Colin had the same thing, you know. Like he saw me differently. He got he let, he let me play the sl the killer slug. Hey, I'm not done. I was really honored by that. You know what I mean? Just just a great, just great feeling. Hey, asshole! I'm not done. How's it going, man? Oh, uh, hi. Casey. Yeah. Oh, uh... What's up with those lyrics? You having a breakout? It, Breakthrough? Uh, Break, uh, yeah, break I'm breaking up? up. I'm breaking oh. up with my movie, Casey. Oh, no. Well, huh? You don't understand what it's been like for me for the past couple weeks. What's happened? What's that? Oh. Oh, easy on that stuff, man. Yeah. Hey, careful, you're not supposed to drink laying down. Whoa, what is in there? Iced tea. No, that's some strong smelling iced tea. What you got, young? Goodness sakes. And 60% whiskey. <laughs> that's not healthy, man. Well, you know what is healthy? Finishing what you start. Darn right. And I did. I finished the movie, Casey. Yeah? Mm-hmm. I brought the computer in here. I spent the last couple weeks of my life editing this movie. Wow. Yeah. And? And it didn't get me shit. Oh. I posted it online, you know? Yeah. I, I just wanted some people to watch it. Some distributors, maybe. Mm -hmm. They got 14 views, Casey. Fourteen. Well, that's a pretty good start, huh? Ten of them were for me. That's ten out of fourteen, Casey. Mm. Well, Nobody gives pick a shit. Up soon enough. Just give it some time. Nobody gives a shit, Casey. Hey, don't worry about it. Guess what? What? I bought you something. What? Well, it's a... No, I no. think you're gonna like it. It's a present. Yeah. No. Alright, but... 
Hold up. Hmm. Something vibrating. Oh, you feeling, feeling the power? No, no. The bed is vibrating. Oh, that's no, that's no. unusual. Hold on. Um, oh. Go on, man. Freaking wait, me wait. out. The phone. <laughs> the phone. Oh, oh my. I, I need a map. Oh shit! Oh, of course. Oh, yeah, I gotta some take privacy. This. Yes, yes. Yeah. Yeah, I, I appreciate the support. Thank you. Wait, I'm sorry. Wait, who? Wait, who did you say you represent? Well, yes, I'm interested. Why wouldn't I be? I mean, yes, yes, obviously, absolutely, yes. Okay, yes, it's so nice to hear from you. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. Bye. You can come back in. Oh, Alright. <coughs> so, who's on the phone? Um, hmm. nobody. Oh. This, uh, telemarketer. Hmm, bummer. But, um,. You were, um, you were saying something to me about a present? I like it, please. Coming into this movie, I uh, knew I was gonna get the part. Just kind of hoping that, uh, you know, there's some hot girls around here to score with and want some toys. Don't look promising. But the movie should be good. I bet you Colin's f***ing Megan. Or Josh. 
I've been to Mars once. The Martian. It was so-so. You know, someone told me that uh, I was going to die once. Laughed at him. Not killed him. What weapon did you use? My dick. You know, I was thinking, uh, for every time Colin says action is about as many times as I've gotten action in increments of ten thousands. I had Canadian bacon one time. Pretty good. I f***ed a Canadian. Colder than usual. Titties. Thank you.